Hello, today we are sitting here in Berlin in a company and they are looking for a head of process management and with me today is... I'm Anton, I'm a company founder and more or less CTO, so the senior gender calls. I'm Tobias, the CFO, so responsible for financials and I'm working here since 16 years and uh, started as the first employee after he founded the company. Excellent. And we um, agreed to have this workshop because it's a very important position for you, right? You want to build future and you are thriving and we need great people, right? Exactly. Definitely. Definitely. Okay, let's jump into it. We talked about the uh, position, head of uh, process engineering, and uh, we are here in your manufacturing hall. Mm -hmm. So just explain in a very short way, what, what are you doing here? Right, well, at the moment what we've got are people commissioning different units in various stages of build. Um, interestingly enough, the units that you see around you right now are all around uh, circular economy applications, uh, hydrogen applications, or for example, applications to reduce the amount of CO2 emitted for different chemical processes. Yeah. So a lot of R&D being done uh, with the primary driver being environmental improvements. Okay, good. Okay, so. And who's your client? I mean, who's hiring your organization? Um, a variety of companies, for example, these are, uh, this is actually one of the world's largest chemical companies that this unit is uh, being commissioned for. This is for the Fraunhofer Institute, for example, where we're helping them use ammonia as a hydrogen carrier yeah. for transporting uh, green hydrogen from one place to another. So a, a mixture of academic institutes and companies. So chemicals, energy, okay. materials. When it comes to optimization, um, what is, um, I know uh, founders and uh, managing directors never like to talk about it, what is pain at the moment? Is it, is it speed? Is it, is it cost? Is it, what, what is right. the pain of your organization? Um, the, the, the pain at the moment is, uh, I, I often say it's a bit like a teenager growing very fast, mm. yeah? So it's, we're going through growth pains right now. And with growth, uh, a bit of chaos has crept in over time. So it's leading to inefficiencies in our current processes. So uh, many of which we know, and those are the most painful ones because yeah. they're not being consequently dealt with. So really dealing with efficiency problems, delivering faster with less mistakes yeah. so that everybody can you know, maximize the impact of, of their position. Okay, yeah. tell me a message for the candidates. If you have a passion for technology development, um, you're a bit idealistic about uh, having a more environmentally friendly future and you love working with people and helping them get the best out of themselves and their jobs. Um, and really a, a company which acts more like a family than a company, um, I think can offer you a really, really exciting position. Tobias, you're CFO of the company and uh, you're already, uh, how, how many years are you with the company? Uh, since 15, 16 years. So you build it. Yeah. <laughs> Was the first employee okay, after good. the founder. Yeah. How would you measure success in this position? And uh, what is important in this particular position for you as a CFO? Certainly it is numbers, of yeah. course, otherwise I wouldn't be CFO. Um, but at the same time, it's important to guide that group. It's a very sophisticated um, group. They have a high understanding of what they do. They love what they do mm -hmm. and they really live, live for it. The challenge for this person is to align on the one side the technical challenge, mm -hmm. but on the other side also looking on the numbers. You need to make money out of that project. But okay. what is really important for this role is that I don't want to grow if we have not the right basis. Mm. And this position is especially for this right basis. Okay. We need to get the processes in done <clears throat> in, in a good um, phase and uh, we need to improve what we currently have. And then the growth is more substantial, more sustainable okay. and more healthy. Um, if you would like to join our team, one thing which you have here is that you can influence your day-to-day -day work and you have an impact on what you do. So if you make a decision, then you see the results in a week or maybe in a couple of months. 